Hi, so today I'll be sharing with you um, about how you can actually balance your bazi and health. Okay, as uh, Fabian has shared that I'm actually a wellness uh, advocate and I have actually embarked on this metaphysics journey um, through a friend during um, a diving trip because um, I'm very, as a science student and a very <laughs> um, practical person, I have always, and as a Catholic as well. La. So I always thought that, yeah, Bazi, uh, metaphysics, feng shui, all these are, are some other religion things. So um, just a disclaimer here that Bazi is actually like any profiling tools that we have used like DISC and all that, except that we don't actually get them to answer a series of questions. So um, we actually um, use actually, uh, ancient astrology method of observing the stars and all that to actually uh, help you decode your destiny map. All right. So it's actually not any form of religion. So those of you here who are new to Bazi, uh, you can rest assured. It's a very practical rest, uh, actually quite scientific way, all right, which I shall share with you guys more. So how do we use but uh, how do we use essential oil and why I choose to use it? I want to start off with this first so that we have the background context of how do we um, correctly use the precious weapon that we have to help us overcome everyday challenges. Okay, and then we will go into the bazi uh, portion, which is our main dish today. And if you can join my telegram, if you're interested in anything uh, matters physics like Bazi, face reading, um, Qi Men uh, date selection, uh, often I'll throw some information in there so you can join me there. Okay, so the disclaimer here is I'm not actually a doctor or medical professional, although I'm talking about health today, but it's purely from a metaphysics perspective. Uh, Perspective, uh, perspective, okay, then I'm not diagnosing anyone in this talk, so don't come and ask me if uh, my buzz is like that, then how are, uh, okay, I know I might train in T, uh, TCM, okay, so what I'm sharing here is purely because so many of us have used the oil and it's true uh, testimony that we have here and also credible source of research, all right, so how do we use this precious oil? We can actually use it through aromatic uh, topical, which is application. And then also um, when I first started doTERRA, it actually surprised me that we can actually ingest this oil. And it is actually uh, on our oil bottle labels. All right. So I am very confident in this product that since then. So is there a best way to use the oils? Mm, for me, I actually assess the power through subconscious way because I'm a trained hypnotherapist. Um, I try not to fight with my kids. Uh, so you see the two of them can synchronize their movement and they're happily together. Yeah, because of this powerful machine here is my diffuser. And actually I put grapefruit in there so that it's a more happier environment for the two of them to be together. So fun fact, why this works because uh, smell is the only sense that actually skip our logic mind. So when you have a very nice, uh, when you walk past a certain biscuit brand, you tend to feel happier and want to purchase it home. It's because of this uh, sensory um, hint that you have in your brain that you eat this thing is sweet and nice and crunchy and then now when you smell again you want to um, have that so you can actually associate great smell with great feelings and it works really fast it's only 22 seconds to reach your limbic brain yeah so are you ready to unravel your bazi your destiny okay so you don't have to if you don't have your bazi plotter right now uh, your bazi chart right now you don't have to worry okay um i want you to focus and absorb like sponge like spongebob okay that's when you get your best um outcome of this afternoon spending your one hour with me so if you haven't seen a bazi chart a bazi chart looks like that it has eight box, uh nine boxes okay but this is the hidden stamp so people don't really really talk about that one so which what the what do they represent okay so year uh pillar it actually represents your network and your month pillar actually represents your career and your day pillar it represents yourself your personality so it's also your own relationship yourself and of course the bottom one is your the other half which is your spouse 
So I call this the past, uh, p a relationship pillar. Then the hour pillar is the fruit of your labor. So it represents your kid, it represents your asset because these are your labor, fruit of your labors, right? So if you see here, there's actually no pillar or no palace that tells you what is health. So how do we know? So actually, in the study of metaphysics and uh, from where I started my yoga practice, right? We believe that our body is a temple that actually heals itself. Okay, our body, our cells are so smart that we can self-repair. We do not, um, you know, introduce uh, any cutting or poison into our body. No sensible people would do that, right? But with the advancement of technology, our health actually uh, comes into a lot of interaction with the environment. So the Western medicine actually improved and they actually um, devised a way of cutting away bad cells from our body, like surgery it was invented, um, medicine was invented to kill the virus, like vaccine and all that, okay? So because why in Bazi we don't have this health thingy is because we believe that it's a qi movement, okay? So this is how the qi should flow. The, and it actually uh, links to the other uh, family in metaphysics study is called the TCM, Chinese, Me Medicine, uh, Chinese Medicine, okay? So the Wu Zhang Liu Fu, okay? The uh, five organs. So we actually believe that if everything actually flows smoothly, then there's not much issue to your health. However, you know, um, if I'm a science student, right? So if let's say energy just flow, nothing will happen. But if one or the other introduce more things, like for example, current, right? The electric current runs smoothly. But if you introduce something else to it, it will give it an electric shock and something will happen. So in this itself, you can imagine it's an electric circuit. Then if something is too much or too little, then it comes into this countering stars here. Yeah, and then what does it mean for us? That is when we can, as a Basel practitioner, we can see the spike in the energy, then we can actually forewarn you that there is such a possible issue in your uh, Basel chart, okay? So if you find this foreign, don't worry, okay? Later I'll tell you how you can get it, all right? So just exhort like a sponge first. Imagine this fire, This uh, pattern here is, a, is uh, the is your Bazi chart, right? Okay, so the natal chart means your uh, original chart, the day that the day, time, and you were born. Okay, so the highest here, this person has wood. And then every year, the energy actually interacts with our natal chart. So this is the foreign current that comes in to inject with our original current. So that's where we actually do a so-called uh, observation or diagnos uh, diagnostic of whether there's issue with you or not, okay? And then some people tell me, wow, like that, actually every minute also have energy. Eh? So how I must every day go and study whether <laughs> wow, the interaction where I fall sick or not. So that's why there is long-term, chronic and short-term sickness, right? Sometimes MC one, two day, maybe because that few days, the energy not good for you. Then you catch some flu or something. All right. But if the issue is due to falls or uh, due to bacteria, or you tell me when I will lie outside, I don't know, because I cannot tell anything that is from caused by bacteria or virus. That is a study from Western medicine, not from the traditional um, bath, okay? And neither can you go to a TCM and say, can you give me anything to prevent my, uh, <laughs> I want to eat everything in the world and not have any diarrhea, also quite impossible, uh -huh. okay? So in this, a uh, whole study, we can actually look at your um, highest point and the lowest point and what is introduced to your chat. So it's so easy. I'm sure after today's session, all of us can walk away and be a battle coach for health. Lah, huh? Okay, so now good for side peek. So here quiz. What is the high and what is the low here? Can anybody tell me? Or you can type it inside the chat box. Wrong answer, nobody is going to flag you, okay? No, no one. <laughs> nah, 
here fire okay ah thanks sally thanks deborah <laughs> deborah or oh, aussie oh, health he health is high okay uh okay over here you see wealth uh, wealth is actually the structure the element here is fire okay fire is the uh is high okay i can see this group all put a lot of emphasis on money uh. <laughs> okay wealth is health uh -huh. okay so the fire here is high and on the in this annual 2020 chart here the water companion here is actually what the element is water okay today we don't look at wealth output all these uh, we look at the red color words uh, okay so the water is high for the annual one yeah great okay good thanks for your participation because if you participate then you will remember okay and then it's better for you to take care of your own health all right so just now we saw the fire is very high so when the fire is high it actually will attack the lung and the large intestine which is the metal okay Ta -da, the metal all right and then it actually will weaken your uh, liver okay so if in such a case when we look at uh, our structure we see fire most important we must understand what does fire uh, governs it governs the heart and the small intestine so heart pumps the blood and then the small intestine delivers the nutrients, right? So if let's say I have too much fire, it actually um, caused me to have uh, attacks my lung and then when it drains my wood that time, okay, you cannot drain your toxic away from your body, okay? You either become very bloated or you become very, um, you become very um, skinny because you, when your fire is too high, you also cannot absorb nutrients properly because it means that your heart or your uh, small intestine have some issues. And then when it goes on to attack other parts of your body, then you will start to see maybe you can't breathe very well because uh, the metal is lung. And then it also can make your liver, uh, the toxic uh, filtration, have some issues as well. And if you have no fire in your chart, okay, some people have very low fire, and that year happen to have water, which next year is actually water tiger year, all right? People who has lower fire in your chart will need to now start taking care of your heart because the water is coming to overwhelm your this uh, sector here, uh, your this element, the fire element here, okay? So what are some of the um, things that you can take that can help you with your cardiovascular health? If you like essential oils, there's the cassia, there's clove and copaiba. Okay, these are actually in tra traditional TCM like cassia and clove are known as the warm, um, warm medicine. Actually, that actually promotes the blood circulations. And of course, if you see that, wow, I must buy three oils uh, to actually support my health. A bit expensive. So actually what I myself do for my family is that I actually purchase this bottle here, which is about $66 retail price. It actually contains the clove, um, the king of frankincense, and a lot of other nutrients in there. So um, I actually take this bottle myself. Okay. Then moving along, the next element. So which is high here? Don't see the companion outlook. I see the red color words only. Yay. I chin. Good. This person has high earth. Yes. Shu An. You are very good. Can be the next uh Basel health coach already. <laughs> yeah, good high water here. So the person's original chart has high earth and this year in uh, year 2020 actually introduced high water element into this person's chart. So what it means is if we refer to this uh, cycle here, the if you are a person with heavy earth, right, like me, uh, it actually the earth governs the stomach and spleen. So 
people like high earth, you can see that they are quite bulky and fleshy, okay, because they absorb and they they um kind of actually protect their body from losing the nutrients. Okay, so like just mother earth, just collect and collect and collect. So people like that need to detox a lot. If not, they will get fleshy and fat like me. If not, you can see that they are quite bulky with muscle. Alright. So people with high earth, okay. Actually, if their chart are quite balanced, it's okay. But the chart we saw just now has uh, high water. So Earth actually controls the water. However, because that gear itself brings in extra energy of water, it will actually impact the heart itself. Okay, And the heart actually kind of supports the Earth. So this whole cycle itself is now kind of out of balance because these two became so strong and it's at longer hits at each other, then it actually will weaken the fire. And then it will actually affect the um, uh, heart and the absorption of nutrients. Okay, And then when the heart and, uh, is affected and the nutrients absorption is affected, then you are a heavy earth person, you don't get enough, that's when you see a sudden drop in your health. Okay, so you always need to detox. And then when your, 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 this fire drops, right, your body will go into an overeating or a kind of like suddenly, I want to, I, I stop eating much because your body go into a defense mode of trying to conceive or uh, con control all your uh, nutrients loss. Yeah. So people like that also like to store emotion, okay? So you also need to detox your uh, mind as well when you go into a high earth position. So if you are having a natal chart with high earth, I really um, like you to practice this 30 days of cleanse and renew, okay? This whole Routine itself seems very tedious, right? Must eat so many things. At first, that was what I thought too, okay? But after I go through one round, I realized that, wow, okay, even with just, uh, I think I, this GX and the these three supplements itself, it really gives a very uh, different feel to my whole energy itself, okay? People see me, um, I think, in April and now, especially my colleagues from TTSH, they say, oh, I, you know, I see a difference in you, yeah. Um, and if you have kids, please, please give them this uh, PB assist. It's really good. My son really will just run whenever I take a pack out. Okay. And then uh, for the kids at night, you can use this oil called Tamer. It's actually pre-mixed. So it's a roller. So you can just roll on your tummy or you can roll on their feet at night. It will actually help them um, to regulate their whole body um, digestive system. All right. And of course, uh, for the adults, you do want to add fiber into your uh, daily routines so that you can actually balance out your whole digestive system. Okay. As well, you can also take digestion soft gel as well as uh, there's also tablet form. So whichever you like. Then the next one. So we are getting good already. Wow, this one is a trick question. Which is high? Anyone? You can unmute yourself or you can just type. Okay. Achin and Angeline, yes. Wow, okay, 100 marks for all of you. Metal is really high here. So is it good? Since wow, metal high, the year energy metal so high. So eh, not bad. Wow. There shouldn't be any clash, right? But too much of everything is no good. So, okay, this stone is another case study, right, where um, actually, uh, recently I saw, saw, saw read this part of the chart for my client uh, who is actually seeing me for next year um, uh, issues. I saw that she has a lot of um, metal in her chart. So I asked her if she's actually suffering from any kind of, uh, you know, uh, intestine issues or lung issues or skin condition because metal actually represents any organs that in, uh, filters impurity or poison. And then she said, oh, no, le. but uh, recently she's getting more um, a bit like under the weather. 
So that's when I tried to prepare her some uh, oils to help her prevent this condition. So if it haven't happened yet and you see such an energy coming in, it is good that you prepare yourself beforehand. Okay, then too much uh, metal actually will hurt the wood, which is your liver. And then this liver is actually a toxin processor. So it will also weaken your earth, the ingestion tract. So what issue you have? You have your whole um, body filled with a lot of toxic, okay? And um, especially this year, it's a metal ox year, still get a few more months to go. So before, in the beginning of the year, I actually keep asking people to go and do blood tests or they should do detox regularly. And especially with people who has more metal in their uh, chart, um, you also tend to get more uh, liver issue, toxin, toxin uh, retention issue. Okay, so like skin conditions such as like eczema, like myself, and I actually have quite bad um, eczema because I'm born in the year of metal monkey. Oops, you know how old I am. <laughs> okay, and uh, people who, who are like that, right, might tend to be a bit gloomy because um, if let's say that person is not able to filter away their um, their emotions, okay, they will keep, keep, keep. Then they will actually filter the wrong thing cause toxic, right? So they have a lot of toxic talk as well, okay? So... These are some things that actually can help you, okay? Like for me, I'm actually regularly on this beginner's trail. It actually, three of them combine the lemon, peppermint, and lavender, combine to become a, um, this thing called allergy bomb, okay? It, it actually kills the itch, okay? And help to expedite the healing of the skin. So I cannot live without it, Um because my skin, uh, eczema doesn't really cure, so it always comes back and forth. So I always have it with me. And it actually works as an antihistamine for me. So when it's very itchy, I actually will drop one drop into the water and I'll drink it so that I don't have to depend on antihistamine because drugs is a, to a form of toxic for me and actually for everyone if you read out there. Okay, so um, breathe actually helps uh, if you are wearing masks right now every day, right? Uh, you can actually put breath into your mask to actually help your lungs cope a bit with the breathing and all that. It also can, uh, because of the content in there, it's also quite refreshing, okay? And because metal also uh, represents um, the your bone, okay, heart stuff, so you actually can take some of the bone essential complex and as well as cardamom. But if you have G6PD, please, you cannot take this oil, yeah? Okay? That's why I separate them away, I separate it away. Then, of course, there's this Mycoplex VM. It has a lot of uh, micronutrients in there that actually helps to support your immune system, all right? So because metal is talking about um, toxin poisons and all that, is so it's really important for you to maintain your um, immune system functioning well, okay? And then when it comes to uh, detoxification, Xandocrine is my go-to um, because I'm heavy in earth. I actually wake up every morning drinking one drop of Xandocrine. And you can also try to have the soft gel, okay? And then this Alpha CRS, um, this one, it also has, it's also a form of bounty vibes, okay? It has a lot of nutrients in it and it can actually help to support and works together with um, the two other multi vibes that I'm taking, okay? Now, moving on. Next one. What is the high here? This chart looks quite okay here, but high is relative, okay? So for example, this one, uh, maybe you all cannot see, uh, cannot decide, right? Cause all 80, 80, we uh, don't tikam, tikam. Okay, the wood, this person is of high wood, okay? And, and the uh, year energy actually introduced the water element into this person chart, okay? So, what will happen for this person? Ta-da! Okay, wood energy, right, actually is 
representing your liver and your gallbladder. So liver actually has no pain receptor. So it's really hard for you to notice anything is wrong with it because there's no early warning sign. So it's very important for you to do regular care for it, okay, before you realize it's too late because um, a lot of time people fall sick, then they go to TCM because they want a natural healing way. But TCM is quite slow, okay? It takes about three to five years to see some effect, okay? Even with acupuncture and all that. So I have a friend who has this um, liver issue and she didn't know it until it's too late. Um, until I start uh, noticing her skin color has changes and all that, then that's when, when uh, I share with her, I say, hey, don't you think you're looking a little bit not too well? Then she noticed it and when she go and do a, a body checkup, it's kind of a bit uh, too late. Like, so when symptoms show, it is uh, quite a scary thing. Okay, and as I have touched on yes, uh, earlier, it's uh, talking about toxic filtration. And Jia Wood actually talks about your, it's actually like a tree, okay? So like a tree, it actually takes care of your spinal system as well. So if a person with too much um, wood, right? Okay, so you are a very hard person. So if you comes into contact with any attack from the metal, it will actually cause you to have some bone issues and you. that's where you need to seek the Western medicine to help you, right? Then, of course, the high wood will also clash the earth which is your nutrients intake, your um, spleen, okay? So it also will weaken the water. So your uh, water flow system will also come into some issues. So um, this, okay, then high metal right just now. Hmm, someone has a question to ask? Okay, just feel free, yeah? Okay, so if let's say you have high metal, you clashes the wood, it will affect the uh, toxin filtration as well. So if you have fatty, fatty liver issue, you will also see yourself as the symptom that is you are getting a bit fat. Yeah. So what do I use? Uh, so just now I shared. Uh, Zendocrine, I actually do drink it every morning. So you can actually try to take the complex, the soft gel. And then this trio here, tada, is the one that I want to share. See, we take it at home. Yeah. But you don't actually have, to, you, it, it's up to you. I buy, I would recommend to buy this every quarterly to at least detox um, quarterly. Okay. So that you can make sure that your uh, liver is always in. A good condition taken care of. At least you take the stress off the um, the liver from processing so much toxic in your body. Yeah. Okay. The next one is the have my forty sixth participant gone to sleep. <laughs> Anybody can tell me this chart. KK, I must give away price, huh? <laughs> ah, okay, Angelina, no need price. <laughs> Angela, Angela. Okay, thank you, thank you. Ah, it's water. <laughs> so, uh -huh. okay, great. Yay. So, all of us now can become faster coach already. So, the water is high. And then, the earth is uh, the new element that is actually being introduced <laughs> yeah internet slow <laughs> thank you thank you for your participation very lonely when i talk to myself you know <laughs> usually i have two-way participation yeah so okay so the earth is the new um new element that is actually being introduced to this person so what does it do if you chinese you know so what happened? The, so the kidney and the bladder is actually governing the flow system. It also governs, if let's say you are a married couple, it also governs the baby making performance. Okay. Uh, performance as in your heat rate, lah, huh? Okay, not the process, yeah. Okay. Uh process, process, yes, yes, it does. Okay. But the heat rate, whether do you achieve an outcome after the end of your exercise? 
Okay, so some of us uh, tried very hard and then they realized, oh, maybe because um, the lack of water. Okay, but if you lack of water, um, I, re I, I remember one of my friends came to me and said, hey girl, I've been swimming for the past six months like crazy, you know. But oh, you know, my IVF still not working. Then I asked her why you actually go and swim. Then she tell me because <laughs> because the the Bazi Shifu I saw at uh, Hong Kong uh, tell me say uh, I lack of water so I must like wear black la then uh, go and swim and all that you know then I will have a kid and I was quite speechless for a moment <laughs> because like I say uh, I'm very logical very practical person I was like why would swimming okay uh, swimming keep you in tip top form to to have a kid but that doesn't increase your heat rate you know and wearing black also yeah make you look more mysterious to your husband but it doesn't really help um yeah to to <laughs> yeah train the yao yeah try train but my girl my friend is a girl uh, so she trained the yao no not much help so um yeah if you actually so sometimes when we are desperate we go to 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 all this um shifu and all that trying to get some uh amulet water or tilsma water drink already you something miracle happened right but remember the story i tell you in the beginning is the alignment of the heaven earth and man so heaven means the star and also the time that which means actually in layman term is the timing okay and earth is really the environment like you are the fisherman, you must know where, uh, what time and where to catch your fish, right? And then you don't go and bring a speedboat so that your moto can frighten the fish, right? You want to use a sampan so that you can row quietly there and then get the best, biggest uh, angoli home, right? Yeah, so um, it's really alignment of uh, time, he uh, heaven, earth and man. So I asked, uh, so I actually told her that, look, you need to find the right timing, okay, where is your, um, you know, more scientifically, when, when you should be having your uh, uh, ovulation period and then, you know, um, do your right stuff, okay. And then, of course, uh, sometimes with the right timing, so from there, I do a date selection for her uh, so that, she can actually have more success and after trying and it's not magic also okay I, I, i'm not saying i give you this date uh, sure tilt one okay like that i am not going to sit here already i go and buy toto every day i know what number to buy okay so metaphysics actually give you a higher chance to 10x your result but it's not a sure thing all right it's also through your own hard work so if I can give you the best date and then you like just half past six, don't really and uh do your best, then there's very little I can do. But with essential oil, okay, you can actually I um she actually used some essential oil to help the make the whole process more exciting. Then in three months time, she actually told me that she's uh, pregnant and uh, very good. She tell me, uh, I need to now take leave. <laughs> So she happened to be my subordinate. La. Then ho, when she take leave, yeah, la, then I'm doing the work alone. Okay. <laughs> so this is a story to share with you. Yeah. So heaven, man, and earth, environment, all this must, right timing, right place. All right. So just now the chart we saw, a lot of water, and then earth comes in. So, uh, so, when the earth comes, it actually attacks the um uh the heart, right? So a lot of water actually uh, originally will attack the heart already. So because why a lot of earth actually um uh, attack the water, it actually excites the water energy, and then the water energy, if good, it goes to uh, support your liver. Usually the chi will go out uh, haywire because usually it goes this way. So if too much earth comes in and attack the uh, water energy, the water energy tends to go and attack another energy, which is the heart in this case, which will affect your cardiovascular uh, issues. And then because it also impacts the lung as well. So this person in this case will become a bit like 泡的水, okay, 水肿, 
uh, it's just a bit fluffy, you know, when you press, uh, when you go buy fish, right, you go and press or uh, for mark the water, water retention, uh, okay, so, um, but if you are pregnant, you have water retention, it's very normal, okay, don't tell me I'm going through a clash, no, okay, it's normal um, body reaction, okay, and if you are an earth person like myself, uh, this is true for me. I have very little in my chart and then eating will actually stress my kidney and bladder. So what does it mean? You get a lot of uh, urinal tract infection if you don't actually drink a lot of water. But this is not because you've got little water then you try to drink more water to compensate it, okay? It's because it is common sense, all right? If you are having um, too much, you absorb uh, nutrients too easily and then your body, your kidney and your uh, bladder, you know, cannot process properly, you need to help to release the stress by inputting more water into it, okay? So... You can also do detox in this case, okay? Like you see, I try to find more thing. The I try to find the same oils that can actually serve more purpose, all right? Yeah. So yes, when you talk about this dialysis thing, dialysis is for a diabetic, huh? It's one thing that the med advanced medicine cannot help, um, because um, it is a pancreas. You cannot go and cut or poison it right so you can only try to um, clean up whatever is in the body the toxic that's there okay so it's very important don't let yourself go does it mean being midway for all five elements means wow this is a very good question you are very enlightened i'll come to that answer later so I try to find some the oils that are repeated so that uh, we don't have to spend so much money. Yeah? Well, one, one organ, one oil or whatever, or 10 oils to read and all that. Of course, I love a lot of oils. Uh, the more, the merrier. But uh, for those starting out, it could be very stressful, right? To buy so many. Uh, so what I actually do is I drink Xanocry, then I actually use this Alpha CRS Plus to actually support because one bottle itself has so much nutrients in it. So it's like cover my immune system, my uh, detox, it detox for me, and then it actually support my digestive system, right? So what do you do? Okay, yeah, so this is what uh, Adele asked me. Is there a best chart or is a chart somoto putre? Okay. A balanced chart means you will be very healthy. Somoto putre is true, but you also then after that hui chue qian because a uh, person if you have a balanced chart uh, means you are not so successful in life because you are everything um if you have been to my other um bazi talk before right each of the bazi and just now you see the wealth and all that right it actually signifies your talent so if you have everything balance right it means there's nothing very outstanding skills that you have so if you want to be successful in life your chart will be imbalanced somehow and actually after consulting so many people right i have consulted more than 100 people this year okay i have not seen a person with the bazi just a pentagon yeah i haven't seen that yeah so Actually, why? Uh, actually, the Chinese have it said very well. Uh, if you understand Cantonese, Choi Do San Ji Yo, Choi San Yan On Lo. It actually translates to, if you have a lot of money, your body will be weak. Because logic, right? You work a lot, then you won't have time to rest or you won't have proper time to eat and for me i will reply email until i forgot go toilet and then i got to pay money to go and see doctor for anti-inflammation medicine yeah so because i go and pay the money to see doctor money parts with me okay then i got back my health okay so why do you want to go and see doctor buy poison to poison ourselves more right so what i do is there a solution? Yes. Do you want to go and take a buzzer chart now and go to TCM and say, come, 
快点 give me a yao fang because my boss coach tell me I have a high fire clash my water. I probably having some issue. Let give me a prescription. The TCM probably look at you and say maybe IMH have to help you because you cannot. TCM cannot help you when they cannot diagnose the clash in your energy in your body energy before it happens. So that's where the pre work I do. I actually do the diagnostic part and uh, so called a prediction uh, if you want. But it cannot happen and I won't able to tell you exactly which um uh what kind of symptom you have then you quickly go and see doctor, right? So what is the solution I have for you? If you know Chinese word Yang Shen, okay. Um, you really need to prevent your body from breaking down. Um, and by the time your body shows symptom, it's usually gonna take you if for chronic stuff uh, because it uh, affects the, the five of major organs, right? Anything that affects the five organs will take a TCM a journey of five to three to five years of recovery. Yeah. So um, I actually recommend that you actually get this package. This is actually a, um, a clean cleanse and restore kit. Okay, it has actually the three um, very affordable uh, lifelong vitality package. We have uh, all the nutrients in it. And then it has the xandocrine, the digestion, uh, digestion um, soft gel, then the PB, um, uh, the PB, uh, as these, uh, all these three up here, the white ones, is actually the clean, cleansing and restoring, uh, the, the cleansing part. The restoration is this part here, okay, and also the lemon. All right, so, but this one, okay, unfortunately, is only a one-time package, okay, all right? So, if you allow me, I can share with you how I actually, um, do some savings lah because I'm a mother of two, right? I still got milk powder and diaper to buy. So the retail price for this actually adds up to $550, okay? And then this is actually a one-time saving you get. But you see, Chu Ge Liang, the strategic guy, <laughs> tell you the best is actually um uh, why I joined doTERRA is because straight away I get a 25% off my um this uh, this retail price here okay and then I actually get to uh, have loyalty rewards uh, rebate up to 30% so you can see in fact you will not be uh, paying much you know because you need to look at it as quarterly you need to do this so I of course want to find the cheapest better way to actually cost save for myself and for my family as well yeah and uh, don't wait until you have something that happens to spend this money because um, like my friend, she told me, hey, can I uh, do anything right now? Um, unfortunately, liver, as you all know, uh, I think the Andrea de Cruz, uh, she actually took some slimming pill and then her Hanson hubby have to share with her the liver, right? You cannot find a lot of Hanson hubby that is willing to part with you their liver, you know? And to be in the... To, to be actually the compatible one to begin with, yeah. Okay, it's really very difficult. Um, so I really highly recommend your um to look into your health with all this package, okay, and to help you, okay, uh to to actually be brave enough to step into this. Um, I actually giving away free party reading worth $168, okay? It's a one hour reading. I can read your whole family chart for you, okay? I will actually uh, explain to you your family dynamics and things like that, okay? This is um, actually for me as a, a way to give back to the community, okay? Given that the times now are so bad, uh, I hope that people can also take uh, good care of their health. So this is a one-time thingy that I'm doing, okay? only for this month uh, enrollment and um, let me know, okay? Enroll to me, huh? okay. <laughs> then, okay, there are friends here who are not in our community yet. That means you are not a Jotara member. No matter who asks you to join this chat, okay, I'm going to give you free 
faster chat. Okay, you scan this QR code here, and then you'll go to this link. You can actually click the get the free button chart. And I will also give you a free profile write-up. Okay. Um, so according to your button chart, I'll give you a free health profile write-up. That means I'll tell you uh, that, okay, look, you have this one high, this one low, or what, what are the areas for you to look into. Okay. Yeah. Can share the URL. Okay. Ta-da. Yeah. I type in. <laughs> okay. So this one is open to uh, all, all your friends who are actually not in the doTERRA member yet. Okay. Regardless whether you are from uh you you know from know this talk from me or not okay and then if let's say you are already a doTERRA member don't worry you can also join my telegram okay i will always throw out some um good dates uh to guide you like today is the initiate date 10 10 uh, uh those who get married today uh, it's a good day. Why? Because it's an initiate day, a day that uh, they start their life together. And then if you buy seeds, your today is the best because initiate day actually means that you start something, but you have to give out something. Okay. So like today I give the talk, I'm also giving out a lot of freebies. Um, also, uh, because this will help me to get good karma. Lah, huh? <laughs> you must tell your friend wedding. Yeah. But you cannot get married last minute as you are, right? Okay, so thank you. Before I go, any questions? If not, I will hand it back to uh, Fabian already. Come, come, ah. Last call, last call, ah. <laughs> so what if the element not strong? There are two fire metal both 60. What does it mean? Um, two not strong. If there's no strong element means uh, no issue, ah. Angela, you're very participative. Why don't you just unmute yourself and ask me what you want to know? I will answer your question. Whatever you ask. <laughs> um, yeah. I'm trying to take a look at my, 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 sis, my daughter's uh, ba And uh. for her, right, uh, basically, she has 260 and 240, 340. Okay. Your, okay, I, I must tell you something. Your kids, right? If your your kids is actually uh below 15 years old, huh? okay? If your kids below 15, is your, Angela, is your kid below 15? I mean 16 years old. Oh, okay. Then this is applicable to her. Because if your kids is below 16 years old, your their structure is not stable yet, okay? So you cannot make decision on their nutrition based on their parts structure, okay? You all need to give them everything. Okay, so sorry, dear. You tell me again, what is the what is the highest? You don't have any, your, your Google chart don't have anything that's more than 61, huh? Yeah, I don't have. 260 and 340. Okay, so high and low is relative. What is your 260 that you saw? Uh, is fire? It's earth and... Wait, uh, sorry, give me a minute. So it's... Fire and metal. Hmm. Fire and metal. Yes. Okay. Your daughter chart inside, huh? Got yeah. any earth or not? Earth is 30%, right? Earth, earth is 40. Earth is 40. Okay. Yeah. So good. Oh, the, it is uh, in mm. earth and water is 40. And uh wood is 30. So it wood is the, uh, the lowest. Mm. Okay. So you do you okay, so this year, right? Your daughter chart, to, is there a spike in in anything? Like the year, the annual, uh, the year chart, the purple color one, is it higher in any the highest, way? The highest is matter. Okay. The color. Okay. So that means there is some interaction here. So by herself, uh, okay, so for if let's say you see your uh, children's chart, uh, uh, your, yourself or your children one, very high here and there, then you say, hey, I bought that chile. Because by yourself, huh, 
like a circuit like I say, right? Mm. There's no issue one. It's only when external uh, energy like the year energy and the month energy that comes in and cause a high spike on one area, then it will actually cause other um, uh, issues to come. Then it will cause issues to come out. So for example, now she has very high metal, right? Mm. High metal just now we learn it is the, uh, the lung and the large intestine on skin condition. So this year you have to take care of her digestion uh, or her toxin uh, level and as well as her skin condition. Okay, the skin condition is not so much of she will have a fall or what. Uh, I cannot predict that she will fall down or bang herself or have bruises, but it surfaces as like maybe from the internal one uh, because mm -hmm. TCM, right? It can quite like that kind, like maybe she get hives or she gets some uh, eczema look alike condition. You have to control it now, otherwise, it can become a uh, chronic issues. Yeah. Oh, oh, I see, I see. Okay, yeah. thank you very much. But whether it will, yeah, no problem, but I cannot uh, on the spot tell you, like, will it be chronic issue because. When we look at yearly, right, so hopefully a lot of things is uh, it come hit and go. So maybe this year I have a bit of um, the leg got some itchy patches. Then next year I'm gone, it's gone already. But if it is chronic, right, it will keep on staying there for some time. Okay, so uh, if I look at your chart, then if let's say I project a few more years down the road for you and it's still there, then I will let you know that it's chronic and you have to do something about it. Yeah, matter, later this year, 100% <laughs> is very jalat. Uh, not very jalat. Lah. You must look at this five uh, cycle. What does it actually will uh, what does it actually uh, cost? Actually, this year a lot of people will see their metal a bit spiked because of the uh, metal ox energy. Okay, and that's why you can see a lot of uh, COVID issues, lah. Ho. Children below 15 can use Ba Zi chart, but Ba Zi in a different way. Okay, you don't read their structure and get us yourself a fright okay right now they need all sorts of nutrients yeah okay so uh doesn't mean very jealous, huh? don't worry as a mentor <laughs> we must see things holistically because one energy hits one area yes it might cause your liver some issue so take care of your liver lor. it doesn't mean that you is uh is very like something bad is going to happen okay Come and attend this talk to know and be assured and be more confident of your health. Not come here and get yourself scared, okay? Uh, so, any more questions? Uh, later chart reading midway means generally that. Uh, Adele, you mean everything okay, okay in the middle? Uh, of course, uh, there are some, some people's chart like that. They are very blessed. Um, but, huh? I, I must say, huh, uh, like I shared just now, right? Uh, if you are very you want to be very successful, there's something that was spiked out. So uh, you understand no money, uh, not very rich la. So you adjust your mindset, law, what is enough. Yeah. But I tell you, uh, the God, uh, God, <laughs> God is fair. I always say God is fair. When you have health, uh, you can always give out in other ways and then you can earn your wealth. Okay, 不会饿死的. <laughs> okay, so no more question. Uh, we have reached 4 p.m. I don't want to hold those who have come here on time. I'll hand the session back to Fabian. Okay. <laughs>